The owner to read out the speech of Maria Adela Antokolets, a Madre de Plaza de Mayo. I quote her. Excellencies, distinguished Excellencies, distinguished delegates, High Commissioner for Human Rights, the mothers of Plaza de Mayo, on behalf of the founder, have been creators and innovators of the rights of the victims of disappeared, such as the grandmothers of the Plaza de Mayo, until we achieved the convention of the for the protection of all from enforced disappearance. Individuals and groups should give impetus to this work with the help from international and national organizations. Both levels should work together. When the Committee on Enforced Disappearance was founded, we saw that it was a specific body dedicated to our work. We as mothers have undertaken campaigns to ensure that all countries ratify the Convention, but there are still many countries to ratify. Fifty-three nations have ratified the Convention, and we need to continue with our campaigns to ensure that more countries can commit to putting an end to this crime against humanity. This is part of our work. We need to have a specific UN body that continues to monitor the implementation of the Convention in each state party. This will help all the relatives of the world to move forward towards uncovering truth and achieving justice. Both need to work together. There were there, we would therefore call for the continuation of the Committee on Enforced Disappearance. At the second anniversary of the Convention, Marta Vasquez, the mother of the Plaza de Mayo that fought tirelessly to achieve the Convention, particularly in the intercessional meetings of the last number of years, the disappeared, she said the disappeared are by our side, guiding us and giving us the strength necessary in order to move forward to ensure that together we will achieve ideals of peace, freedom, unity. In other words, happy communities living in peace, having fulfilled the dreams of thousands who had to sacrifice, had their dreams uh, flouted. We would call for support for our cause. We raise our voices and we would call for the Committee on Enforced Disappearance to continue in its efforts. Our voices are the ones that give it sense. Thank you. Thank you very much for your statement.